since day one in Colorado. Really day two, we packed in yesterday and today we're scouting to see if we can see some sign, try to figure out the game plan for in the morning, which is open the day of season one, rifle season. So we're not gonna go too deep today, kinda stay on the perimeters, just look and see if we can see where the herd, are, herd is or just want to figure out where we want to be in the morning when the sun rises. So you can look down that way, you can just see we're walking the trail. And we're going back up to the top of this mountain. saw a few, a three mule deer just in, all three bucks. So one of them was pretty nice, but I struggled to get video of the biggest one, but I got just a little bit. So we're going to ease on down this trail headed east, see if we can't get in the low land a little bit. Still yet to see any real elk sign. The wind's blowing pretty good. To set up here on a lower look at a little low area, a little valley. We'll see, uh, see if anything comes my way. Be a lot of hunters in the woods this morning, so maybe that's something I'll least boot by me. We shall see. This is day two. Day one of honey. We scouted yesterday. We'll see what happens.
Oh, we walked a long way. Fell out of blind. Then we're back about at the camp. Sun's starting to go down. I'm exhausted. Tomorrow's a new day. Try it again. My partner saw one bull this morning, but couldn't tell if it was a legal bull or not. So he let him walk. Didn't give him a very good look. Um, one of the other teams that's with us, they saw a couple elk. Uh, one was just a big spike. And the other, I think, was a little bigger, but he was over on private lands. There wasn't nothing they could do about it. I'll let y'all go tomorrow. See what happens. Cedar tree for a little protection and uh, see if we see anything come out. Well, it's just kept on snowing. See the ground's a whole lot. Starting to accumulate. Deal. Unfortunately, 
in the excitement, I didn't take time to hit record on the GoPro. Um, they were running through here, heard of them. And uh, I could see his horns coming through. It was clear that he was a legal buck. Waited for a very small opening. And when he entered it, I hit him. So, very excited. This is what it's all about. Day two of Colorado elk hunting. Well, it is the last day of gun season, of the first gun season in Colorado. And we have been hunting public land. Uh, it was a group of six of us. Day two, I was able to kill a six by six. Uh, there's been several close calls where people maybe didn't quite get the shot or um, some other hunters pressured them um, and uh, made the elk move, uh, but that's that's part of public land hunting. Um, so the other five still have not killed one. They are out this morning, the last day, and I'm um, hoping that they will be able to connect at least one or two others. I, I hope I'm not the only one that kills one this week. Um, for several reasons. One being we really like to take some some more elk meat home. But uh, that's hunting. There's no guarantee. It's a beautiful morning this morning. Right at freezing. No wind. Very light and variable if any. And uh, maybe it'll be the day that the other guys make a connection. Anyway, this is our base camp here. And uh, you can see the tent set up behind me. Got a little cook tent there. And uh, over here. <coughs> a little fire pit. Actually a little, little shower house there. And uh, <coughs> we, 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 we figured that we were... Uh, we're pretty advanced so we were able to have a hot shower here at a remote camp but it was pretty nice a little battery powered pump running through uh, pushing some water through some copper coals through our fire pit and then uh, up on uh, a little limb that we had across there and uh, we were able to uh, get a hot shower and that was nice huh? so that's gonna wrap up 2017 elk season Colorado it was fun especially for me I got an elk that's what it's about here's my little birdie friends